けすぐにペアはい。Siakam is out there with Turner. Then there's Tyrese Halliburton. Then it's McDermott. And it's Nemhard in at the two. You know, both these sides, Doris, are very stout on the defensive end. Scoring might be tough to come by. Well, you have two coaches who believe that championships are won with outstanding defense. So, number one, you try to contain the ball. If a rotation is required, it is on time and on a string, and they challenge every shot. Just special defensive units. Martin wide open, he fires, controls the rebound, and puts it back up and in. Just in a perfect position to grab that rebound and then get the put back. Turner with a screen for Halliburton. Fires for three. The shot by Turner, no good. Here are the Hornets with the ball. They went to Indiana for their last meeting with the Pacers and came out with a win. And the last time they faced this club, rebounding was their big advantage. And he's not going to miss that sort of an opportunity from deep. Got to credit the defense. They found a way to stop them, and that's never an easy task. Well, in two years at the helm, nope, he's defended by McDermott. Out to Bridges. And another three for Charlotte. And there now we get a chance to check out the standings out east already. We are in December. The league dunk out of it, too. And my question is, where was the help? Someone rotate over and challenge. Here's Dixon following the score by Indiana. Driving the lane. And he gets the basket. Officials blowing the whistle, so a chance at the line for one more. How about he has yet to miss 4-4 to start. Nearing the midway point of the season now, GA, what do you think is most important for teams to focus on at this point? Williams, a screen on Halliburton. Dixon. Good for the fifth time in five shots. He remains perfect. Pick works well there. Not much resistance from the D. It takes incredible effort to stay connected to the hip of... And Halliburton's got the ball here for the Pacers. Nine-point game. Pass to Siakam. Rejected by Dixon. And they're able to recover late in the game so far. A very solid start for them. 
Here's Dixon. Oh! oh. He's going to put that one in his scrapbook. Insane dunk. And now they're starting to rub it in. Build up a lead, and here we go, baby. It is showtime. And that's life above the rim. This guy missed many of those. He's one of the keys to their floor spacing. On the stripe, and it drops once again. The bucket from Dixon. Dixon's got 16. Dixon passes to Miller. Miller off a bit from Dixon. And it's the Hornets, another three. Asserting yeah, himself. Appreciated about his effort in that game was the effort and work on the glass. What a well-rounded performance. And so here's Charlotte following the three-point attempt by Pascal Siakam. And he just dangles from the bucket <laughs> after sending that one through. And you can see which team thought that triple was going to fall. it right over Turner and this sort of awesome this team is in charge of this game well there's a swagger out there you can see it on the court that they possess and are not afraid to show it either that's Halliburton. so that's the group out there for Indiana here's Dixon this game an incredible scoring display for him one thing you hear nowadays Doris is that there's not enough defense do you agree with that I don't in this way, Kevin, I, I believe we must redefine the opportunity he fails to convert very often. And let's head over to the sideline and catch up with David Aldridge. Hey, guys, the captain in the last game against Toronto got the job done. He scored 46 points, but the big standout was his season high in rebounds. What an effort on the glass. Some really gaudy numbers from him. A show for the ages. We'll see if he has an encore tonight. And just over three and a half minutes played here in the second quarter. Shots good by Miller. And nice little pass to Dixon. And he hits it just before the shot clock expires. Now it's a six-point Hornets lead. Kevin, such a dependable defensive anchor. Someone that just reads shooters well, knows when to go after the block. And so here's Charlotte after the miss three from Doug McDermott, and it's in there. Well, they're winning largely because of this guy's play. He has been sensational. Halliburton's got the lead up to one now for the Pacers. Here's Dixon driving inside. Some power coming from the PG. Ah, that's right. GA seeing more and more of that. The now McConnell. And there's the pass to McDermott. Good. And McConnell gets the assist. McConnell's got his third assist on the night. How many times have we seen a possession like that from them today? Ending with a basket coming off a pretty pass. Dixon. And the jump to finish it off. A ah, beauty. And I gotta say, sort of surprising he goes for a slam that difficult. Williams with the block. Down low, here's Dixon, and he jams it after taking the nice feet on the run. That should give him a nice little jolt. In for Bridges. Charlotte moving the ball around. Shot clock at six. Here's Dixon, and he finishes nicely on the layup. Dixon's got four this quarter. Well, we've seen that movie a few times, haven't we? An easy bucket in the paint. Ackham against Bridges. Just five to shoot. Williams has a screen for Bridges. Sinks the three-pointer. Bridges has got his second bucket. Williams has got his seventh rebound here tonight. Miller for three and it's the Hornets another three 
Loves hitting those threes. It's Here's Dixon. He has 38 in the game. Here's Martin. He takes it in. Right on the bucket. We've had more parity in the league the last few seasons. Well, Kevin, the playoffs have been pretty hard to predict lately. I will give you that. There's been only one repeat champion in the past decade. It's a competitive league. A nice shot by Dixon. Yeah, they're relying on their three-point shooting and getting pretty good results. Ten here in the third quarter. They've made three of six. Here's Dixon. He's covered by Halliburton. A nice shot by Dixon. Now, here's Bridges. Eight points for him. There's a screen. Six to shoot. A nice shot by Dixon. Well, individually, he is doing everything he can in this 12-minute session, but he's, to me, this has simply stated, been a complete lack of defensive attention and focus all night long. Williams a screen. Bridges, no one around him. Drills the three-pointer. Bridges has got 11 points. The rebound by Richards. Richards got his sixth rebound on the night. Here's Bridges with the drive, and Bridges jams it in. Springs in his shoes. Clear the deck when Miles Bridges is coming through, folks. Things really clicking for him at the offensive end. Oh. And not just the score, Miller condition as well, showing great vision on that play. Chance points. I mean, they have been terrific on the offensive backboard. Here's Dixon for three, Bridges, and the three ball is good. He's been a. The Pacers making the shot. Martin, the pass to Bridges. And it's the Hornets, another three. Man, he. Smiling when he told the team, we're up. Game line is working. Go out there and have fun. It's always fun when you're up late, guys. Thanks so much, David. Here's Dixon. And good! There's another. That gives him 51. Put a rough first half behind him. He's absolutely crushing it here in the second. Here's Dixon. And another one falls. And this game has his name written all over it. Greg, he's been phenomenal in offensive onslaught. One step ahead of the defense all game long. Here's Dixon, and that one clearly a foul. Gets the whistle and two shots. Been thinking about kicking it out. No reason to do so there. He was going to leave, no doubt. Here's Halliburton, and they'll keep possession. From outside, off. Now guarded by Siakam. To the inside. Again, what an avalanche! And he's been dominant here thus far. Shouldering the offense, GA really taking it to the opposition. So it's Indiana picking up the win. Probably a little closer than they would have liked it, but a win nonetheless. Yeah, but I really got a sense that the fans gave them that emotional boost that was needed down the stretch. This crowd, man, they were electric. And that'll do it, folks. For Doris Burke, David Aldrich, Greg Anthony, and the rest of our terrific 2K Sports crew, this is Kevin Harlan saying thanks for watching. See you later.